Okay, so the passage that I want to share with you today is a picture of what God has done with our sin. It comes from Isaiah chapter 38. King Hezekiah says, In your love you kept me from the pit of destruction. You have put all my sins behind your back. Now, I have four daughters, and so as they've grown up, I've I got to see each one of them try to keep something from me uh, multiple times. And honestly, who are we kidding? We adults do this too. When we do something embarrassing or say something stupid, we try to hide that so that we're not embarrassed anymore. Uh, I remember one time when my daughter, very recently when my daughter Margaret was eating lunch and she started to sneak away from the table uh, and I looked up from the living room and said, Margaret, where are you going? And what do you have in your hand? She had something down by, by her thigh, kind of hidden behind her leg. And uh, she reluctantly came over and showed me that it was a little, a little package of Smarties that she was going to her bedroom to eat. Or there was another time when my daughter Allison uh, was, uh, got caught red-handed doing something she wasn't supposed to. And, uh, and she said, don't see me! As if, you know, that would save her from, from getting caught. Well, in this passage in Isaiah, Hezekiah is saying that's what God has done for us. Uh, this is in the Old Testament, so God looks forward to what his son Jesus is going to do on the cross, and he says, because of what he's going to do for you, and you're looking forward and trusting in him, I put your sins behind my back. I can't see them anymore. I see you, but I don't see your sins. That's a pretty pretty comfort comforting thing, because he doesn't say, your sins don't matter. They do. They're bad. Uh, he doesn't say, uh, you've done enough to like make those sins go away. He just says, I will put those behind my back. I will not see them. This is what God does for us because of Jesus.